given the matrix the matrix is here given that the matrix A is given by this 1 3 2 2 K 4 then K 2 negative 4 is singular determine two possible values of K uh -huh. so um, this is a matrix solution so the matrix is given by a equals to this is the matrix one three two two k four k two negative four so i think that this matrix is singular so if a matrix is singular then it means the determinant of the matrix must be equal to to zero must be equal to zero therefore uh, we shall say that uh, now we now expand this determinant we shall start with one so we have one so when we take this one we plug this column and plug this also we remain k4 to negative 4 so we have k4 to negative 4 then the signs alternate positive negative so we are 3 so when we pick this 3 we plug this column and of course this row so that you remain 2 4 a negative 4 2 4 k negative negative 4 then we have plus 2 these 2 plug this column and this row so we remain with 2 k k 2 2 k k 2 this one must be equal to to 0 because we had we we have been told that the the matrix is a singular one uh -huh. so once we have this so we can now expand this this now two by two remember this was a three by three determinant so we reduce it to a two by two determinant like that so, so here we have one into now you take k times negative four we have negative four k then minus 2 times 4, that is 8, minus 3 into 2 times negative 4, we have negative 8, minus k times 4, minus 4k, plus 2 into 2 times 2, that is 4, minus k squared k times k 8k squared then we put 2 to 0 so we now open the bracket 1 times um, 1 times negative 4 we have negative 4k 1 times negative 8 we have negative 8 negative 3 times 8 we have plus 24 negative 3 times negative 4k we have plus 12k then plus 2 times 4 we have 8 minus 2 times negative k squared minus 2 k squared equals 2 to 0 so at this point we collect like terms was this is k this is k we have k so we have this so we have minus 2 k squared 
then these things are negative force this will have plus 8k when you take negative 4k plus 12k will make 8k uh -huh. minus 8k cancels with positive minus 8 cancels with positive 8 so we remain with plus 24 equals to, to 0 so here we can divide through by the common factor here is 2 we can divide through by 2 2 here will remain negative k squared then plus here we have 4k then plus we have 12 equals to 0 equals to 0 so here we have two numbers so we take the coefficients of k squared which is negative 1 times 12 <coughs> so we have negative 12 two numbers when we add we get 4 when you multiply you get negative 12 the number is positive 6 and negative negative 2 so this is positive 6 so this becomes minus k squared then here we have plus 6k minus 2k <coughs> plus 12 equals to 0 so we can factorize out so the common factor between k squared <coughs> negative k squared and positive 6k it will be k so we have uh, k into negative k and then plus plus 6 and then the common factor between negative 2k and positive 12 it will be um it will be minus 2 into plus plus 2 into minus k then plus 6 equals to to 0 equals to 0 so here we have k plus 2 into uh, minus k plus 6 equals to 0 therefore we have k plus 2 equals to 0 so it will make just 0 equals negative 2 call it k1 then you can get k2 from there minus k plus 6 equals to 0 negative k equals to negative 6 therefore k2 equals to 6 therefore the two values of k are 1 negative 2 and then positive 6 thank you and listening.